The Ministry of Agriculture, Fisheries, Physical Planning, Natural Resources and Cooperatives has implemented an action plan with the view of addressing the agricultural damage caused by the passage of Hurricane Elsa. Anissia Antoine begins the broadcast. The Department of Agriculture, Fisheries, Natural Resources and Cooperatives conducted an initial assessment on the impact of Hurricane Elsa. The assessment looked at damages on the various extension and advisory services, including the Fisheries Department, Livestock Division and Crop Extension Division. According to Permanent Secretary of the Department of Agriculture, Fisheries, Natural Resources and Cooperatives, Barrymore Felicier, losses totaled more than $34 million, with banana and plantain farmers suffering the most, with reported losses of 80% or more of their farms. We're looking in the region of 2,400 acres to 2,800 acres affected and over 600 farmers affected by that, in that sector. We also saw to a certain extent um, trop, fruit trees, root crops, vegetables were also affected in the crop extension area. In terms of fisheries, we saw that there were some damaged vessels by the Denry area, um, minimal losses though. We also saw CMOS farmers in the areas of Poile became affected, uh, the headline losses of CMOS. In the area of livestock division, we saw about 70% damage to sheds, animal sheds. We saw some mortalities in terms of swine, poultry in the livestock sector. Um, so these areas have been affected. In terms of forestry, we saw some slides in the forest reserve. Also, you would have noticed that there would have been some fallen trees and some damaged trees in that area. Mr. Felicier reiterates the Department of Agriculture's commitment to assisting farmers. He notes that the Ministry of Agriculture, Fisheries, Physical Planning, Natural Resources and Cooperatives is currently working on a support package for farmers. We are here today trying to finalize that support package and it will be communicated to the executive, to the cabinet of ministers for their deliberation and for their final approval. So once that is received, then we will communicate to our stakeholders what that support will be and in what form it will take. Farmers are advised to report their losses to their respective extension divisions. The extension facilities are located in Babono, Bexo, Marigo, Soufre, Viewfort, Urge and Richfort. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anisia Antoine reporting.